What's up internet? My name is Trident Lion and welcome to my backyard pool area. So this is another vlog episode that I wanted to do just so I can get a little bit more comfortable speaking in front of the camera because I do want to film more of things that go on in my day-to-day -day life so you can get to know me personally more. Of course you can imagine uh, being in front of the camera could be a little nerve-wracking for some people including myself and that's why the majority of my videos have been done in the format that they are which is the whiteboard animation summaries. It feels more comfortable for me, but I also want to get more familiar with making videos like this. So I can give you and other subscribers some insight to what I do in day-to-day -day life. Right now, we have a thunderstorm about to happen. This is my backyard area with the pool. What I'm currently reading is one of my favorite author's book, Ryan Holiday. And this book is called The Perennial Cellar. I always have had trouble saying this correctly, but I think it's called a perennial cellar. And the idea of it is how do you create something that's timeless, that will be something that will last for a super long time, like an icon, or think of a book that has been around for so many years. One example that comes to mind will be uh, Marcus Aurelius' book, Meditations, that's been around for thousands of years, and it's still valid to this day. So how can you create something that last for a really long time. Things that, I guess I can make a prediction that might not last that long, that won't be a perennial seller, is like those fidget spinners. <laughs> or something like that, something that's just a, a quick trend, something that's very interesting in the moment, and a lot of people like it, but it doesn't really stand the test of time. Some of the things that I've done recently, I went to the amusement park with some of my friends that I've known for a really long time. These are super close friends of mine, Mark and Miles, as you can see. And we went on so many great rides around Epcot and Hollywood Studio. It was a super blast to catch up with some old friends that I don't need to see all the time. I play with them on Overwatch once in a while, which is great, and I'm very grateful to have them in my life. I guess one of the hardest things about making a vlog like this is just figuring out something to say. Because you could just, there's so much to talk about. It's not, like, it's not that there's nothing to talk about, but there's, there's so much to talk about. It's like, what do you choose? What do you pick? Do I talk about what I do for work? Do I talk about what I do for fun? Do I talk about goals? Do I talk about vacations? What do I actually talk about in something like this? So, I don't know. Okay, this is what we'll talk about. Let's talk about Instagram. If you guys haven't already, definitely check out my Instagram. It's just at Trident Lion. I wanna to get to know some of you guys as well, so feel free to send a message. You want to share your profile with me and see what you're up to. I always like collaborating and getting to know other creators that are out there, not just with video, with any type of artistic pursuit, whether it be painting, whether it be video, whether it be music, whether it be you name it. Pottery, I don't care. If it's artistic, I want to see it and please share that with me. I would love to be able to meet some of you guys and collaborate in person. Now, I'm very excited because I started doing this YouTube channel in October 2016, like really starting to produce content and the channel is just about to reach 5,000 subscribers, which I am super grateful for. Now I strive to continue to provide value to the channel for you and other subscribers alike, with the goal in mind to level up. Because with the gaming channel that I have, you can tell that I like video games. I've been playing video games for a while, and a lot of my friends do as well. And I like to look at life similar to like a video game, like a comparison. The idea is to help level up your character with whatever you want to do in life. The idea of this channel is to help you specifically level up in a variety of different ways. Whether you're looking to improve it with your relationship, whether you're looking to improve with marketing, with music, you name it. Check it out with all the playlists and they're there for you. On my phone, I, in the notes on my phone, I do a lot of different, you know, journaling or ideas and things like that. And let's just read the idea that I had for this vlog. All right, so, okay, this is what it says. I can talk about my top five podcast: the Joe Rogan Experience, the Tim Ferriss Show, the Aubrey Marcus Podcast, Gary Vyoda Experience, and Lewis Howells School of Greatness. 
Now, if I had to add a bonus one, because I do love Overwatch, and if any of you play Overwatch, please comment below who your main is. My main is Farah. The podcast I listen to is called Omnic Lab. So Omnic Lab, I'm super grateful for. I listen to you guys when I'm in the gym, sometimes on my way home from work, and I love that the fact that they bring top 500 players on and they have some strategies and techniques. So if I had to pick my top five mains for Overwatch, for all you Overwatch fans out there, Farah is number one, and she is skies above everybody else, literally skies above. Second will be Junkrat, and then after that, it's gonna be just a mixture of uh, D.Va, Lucio, Reaper, Symmetra, May, Torbjorn, and recently I've been on a Gemji kick, and I continue to play him because I want to become really, really good with him. Well, I mean, that about wraps up the vlog. I mean, it's kind of random and all over the place, but like I was explaining in the beginning, I want to become more comfortable with making videos like this. That way you can get to know more of me, see some of the ins and outs of what I do in day-to-day -day life. Think of what I say at the end of every one of my videos, if you watched them to the end. And if you do, I'm super grateful and I love you for it. But what I say is always be learning, always be creating, and always be inspired. And I mean that because that's something to live by because as long as you're learning, as long as you're creating, and as long as you're inspired, then suffering will be reduced in your life. And I truly believe that. So if you guys like this vlog, please leave me a like. Also, comment below how you found this channel. What was the first video that you saw and what was your impression? And I'll be super grateful for it. Thanks again for being a viewer and a subscriber. I'm super grateful for it and I appreciate your attention and I strive to provide as much value as possible to you and other subscribers alike. And until the next video, always be learning, always be creating, and always be inspired. Not a lot, but they up to something.